here we are in Cairo in front of the Great Pyramid, which is just kind of crazy. <laughs> and I'm here with Anne Marie Warhatch. And Anne Marie, where are you from? Fairbanks, Alaska. So we're almost at the end of the tour. How has it been for you? Fabulous. <laughs> it's been really fun. Yeah. And um, I really enjoyed seeing all the temples and the ruins, um, mm -hmm. especially because I'm an engineer. And it's just amazing to see how people could build these structures Yeah, way back when. Right, it's amazing, isn't it? It yeah. is. I know that you've just been like, it's job, it's jaw dropping it almost is. everywhere we go. Yeah, and so many things where we still don't even know right. how they how they did it. Yeah. 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 So now you did a soul adventure a bunch of years ago, and now have come on the trip. So it's kind of a nice combination, isn't it? It is. It yeah. is. It was really this whole adventure really changed my life, mm -hmm. and um, for the better. <laughs> <laughs> Good. And. Um, Ever since I did the Soul Adventure, this mm -hmm. was one of the trips that I wanted to take. Yeah. Well, and the thing that's been so wonderful, I think, also, is that you were here with your son. Yes. So talk about that a little bit. We had a great time. Um, and at first, I wasn't sure he was going to be able to come because mm -hmm. he hadn't done a Soul Adventure. But actually, since I had done my Soul Adventure, I've been... Um, passing on the teachings that I got mm -hmm. to him and he's been very open to the receptive to all the yeah. learning that. So it worked out really well and he fit he, he fit really well with the group. He was just great. <laughs> Absolutely yeah. fantastic. I was so glad that he was here with us. And it was so great when we bought something heavy. <laughs> <laughs> I know he helped me with he helped me with my suitcase a bunch of things too, which <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so I'm sure you had people who said to you, Oh my gosh, you're going to Egypt are you now? How, how have you felt here as far as the safety issue? I felt safe all the time. I thought the Egyptian people were incredibly friendly and gracious. And um, I guess the best part was the kids always wanted to do selfies with us. <laughs> <laughs> it was kind of overwhelming. I did about 50 selfies in the mosque. <laughs> and it was just like one friend would one kid would do it and then all these other kids would come up well I want a picture with the American yeah. it yeah. was really fun but yeah. they were very very friendly and they wanted to know about us right I never felt uncomfortable with it at all oh no I mean they're just so warm and friendly and I think it's something that you know we don't have that as Americans until they come over here and we'll experience it that's true yeah so let's see how has it been for you I love Rafat. <laughs> he is so much fun. He, he, he's so knowledgeable. And then on top of that, he he's witty and he brings humor to everything. Mm -hmm. And um, I think the funniest part was when he caught me looking at the um, one god of fertility in the Karnak Temple. I was <laughs> and he was like, oh yeah, that's what you think it is. <laughs> so happy to meet Luke and have him here. So, so glad you were on the trip, honey. Yes, I was <laughs> glad too. Thank you. 